Hello YouTube and Epic 7 players. Let's talk about the upcoming changes to the summoning pools. Starting off with um, my three biggest points. One, all the pools are going to stay where they are. There will not be any pools going away. And they're just being restructured. Two, pity pools are a thing that we will have to live with. And three, the flux of ML into the Covenant slot is okay at best. Okay, let's cover these one at a time. Everything is going to stay where it is. This is actually okay. When I last covered the changes when they were initially announced, I felt the system was fine. I still kind of feel that way, and I'm glad that it isn't changing from this front. The pity pulls uh, on the uh, Mystic Metals, it's kind of neat. If you don't get a five-star ML hero from Mystics, you'll get one, you'll get the featured one. Let's say you didn't want the current five-star ML on the Mystic banner, so you get close to that 200 mark. Yes, it's 201 pulls on the Mystic banner to get the pity pull. Let's say you're at like 190. You stop and you save until you see a five-star you want on the banner. It's a cool change that'll allow players to plan out their pulls a little better than just throwing metals into the void. Uh, Moonlights in the Covenant pool is okay. For those who don't know, on the normal book bookmarks, you're going to be able to have a 5% chance to get an ML unit. They were kind enough to take that 5% from the artifact pool, and not just anywhere either. They took it from the three-star artifact pool. Personally, this is the best part of the change. Keep in mind, though, this is for any ML unit. If you think you're getting a 5-star, remember that's going to end up being like 0.15% for an ML 5-star in this pool. It still is kind of hype, though. The other thing that's neat is that Mystic Metals will start to appear in the uh, secret shop soon. They're reducing the amount of friendship bookmarks you're going to see, so that's a really cool change. We'll have to wait and see how much they cost, though. And they're going to give you 50, so it'll still be one pull, just like if you find regular bookmarks. As a side note, I'm really interested how the new imprint system will work that they've been announced for October. Currently, an imprint only works on the slots given for that imprint and do not benefit the hero itself. With the new system, you might not need the team imprint, and you could choose to have the unit imprint on itself and be selfish. This res can result in like a stat boost or even skill boosts. Like I said, I'm sort of excited to see what these are like and I'll keep you updated when they announce it. I know it was a short video, but thanks again for watching my videos, everyone. It means a lot to me when I see people are liking the content, and I like it when people pop into my stream and say that a video was helpful. So please, like the video if you liked it, sub to the channel, drop a comment on what you think the upcoming think about these upcoming changes uh, to the summoning system, and we'll see everybody next time.